All right, so Unk was on Off the Record with DJ Academics. You know, it's never too early. It's never too late for some Charleston White content. Mind you, I don't know what's going on in the Off the Record podcast. I don't know what's going on in the, uh, in the uh, audio department. Not the audio department. I don't know what's going on in the frame department. But this shit looked like it was shot on a goddamn Samsung fucking cricket phone. Shit all lagging and shit. I thought it was my OBS messing up. It's this nigga academics. Yo, yo, the, the Spotify budget ain't high enough. What the fuck is going on in in the studio? This podcast. So this is a little, it's going to be a little choppy, but just bear with me. We seen for free. Click the link in the bio chat. Let's get it. I would agree that maybe he's not getting Shit was shot off of a goddamn cricket phone. Hey, because he showed us. The OnlyFans money. Seems like he's doing pretty good with the OnlyFans. So what happens is he's not showing us music royalty money. That's what I'm saying. Mm. One thing we know about rappers and niggas, we go stunt and show what we got. Got we go show what so he didn't show the rappers money. He showed the OnlyFans money. So he's having to make money off his life content, huh? How do you deal with a woman like Sean Rock. She you, seems like uh, you kick her ass. And <laughs> Already. Leave her alone. Wait, hold on, hold on. I, I think this is a bigger discussion. There's this program or this app. It's called Zeus. Any y'all back there familiar with it? Let me tell you this. If you're dating a girl and she got that shit, she subscribed to that shit. All she's learning is ratchetness, fighting, cussing, acting out in public. Anything that people would say. This is not how a woman who has a man and who's feminine and submissive would act. These chicks are, it's all about getting to it. It's Bad Girls Club on steroids, the entire thing. I turn or break that shit up. Hey, yo. Okay, but we're in a time now where because of feminism and a few other things. Nah, I don't want to hear that, bro. Where the feminism women at when he getting cracked over the head with a Hennessy bum? Man, look, look. Do I gotta do I gotta play my daily man? I don't never see the feminist woman coming out when Blueface get cracked over the head with a Hennessy bottle. Hold on, where is this at? Face, Sean Rock. Oh, she don't even know how to spell. The, I don't even know how to spell her name. You know what I'm saying? Nah, not no jumper. What a feminist woman for this. Hello? You see my head? <laughs> you see what it looks like? Looks crazy, right? But I'm no bitch, so I'm gonna put this paper towel right here, put my hat on, and do what a nigga with nuts would do. But you, what you're gonna do, you're gonna do what a bitch would do. You can sit in the car and oh, I'm tired. I just got into a fight and I'm tired. Alright, so get your up. Get out! Crazy. You make no sense. You tough, right? I thought you wasn't a bitch. I thought you were super hard, super tough. You're acting like a bitch right now. You're sitting in the car hiding from, from the real shit. I know. Him, him, him calling her a bitch is wild. <laughs> so get out! But he hot. He, she just went on top of him with a handy bottle. But we not going home. You wanna fight me about some shit that you called me, that I called you back. Now you gonna cry about it like a bitch. I don't give a fuck what hurts. I'm hurting too. Nobody cares about the man. They only care about the bitch. That's, oh, wow. That's facts. That's facts. No, I want you to understand. Imagine if Blueface, now all jokes aside though, imagine if Blueface would've would have went over the top of her head with a Henny bottle. You know how, you, you know how canceled he would be in a heartbeat? You're a bitch and I'm not. That's what I want you to understand. Until you what? Then come on, show me you're not one. You acting like one right now. He, he antagonizing. He he gaslighting the shit out of her though. I ain't gonna lie. You acting like a straight bitch. You sit in the car. That's what a bitch would do. No, it's just disrespectful. When was it ever disrespectful? Cause I'm a man. That's so unfair. Life is unfair. You can kiss a bitch, right? And it, and it's just a girl, right? If I kiss a bitch, it's it's unfair. Yeah, touche. Get over it. It's the difference between men and women, bitches and niggas. You need to pick a side and stay on there. You you steady straggling the fence. You want to be a bitch one day, and you want to be a nigga one day, you want to be a bitch this day. You want to pick one. I she ain't been hit like a nigga yet, though. Sure, treat you like whichever one you want to be. 
When you start acting like a bitch, I'll treat you like one. Sitting here like somebody hit you in your head with some glass. I just need five minutes. Spit out your talk, He mad as hell, though. You know what I'm saying? He got cracked in the head with a Henny bottle. I'll be mad as hell, too. <laughs> you feel me? Like, oh, yeah, this is this is what I, this is the video I wanted to see. Vacuuming glass out that man's skull. Shorty, 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 shorty crazy. Shorty crazy. But that's enough. That's enough. Enough. When when salons karate chops Jay Z, it's like yeah that bitch ass thing must have did something. When sweetie, by the. Karate kick, motherfucking Quavo. Yeah, that nigga must have hot something. He must have been cheating on her. It is kind of incentivized nowadays. And I heard you talk about how you think he should deal with it, but yeah. I think it's, we're in a different time. Ray Rice the bitch. Now you <laughs> can't. I will. No, you can't. Said I will. If you do me like that, I'm, I'm just gonna... She just hit you over the head with a handy bottle. Got glasses stuck in your I head. I hit over her head with a pole. <laughs> no, no. And we both go to jail. <laughs> When the police show up, man, this bitch. Don't don't take this advice, cause nowadays if you put your hands on a woman, you're going to jail. Don't take this advice. You're gonna have to pull the phone out and you're gonna have to record. You know what I'm saying? You know you come on, bro. You know it, it's come on. A woman could push us, smack us, spit in our face, disrespect us, violate us. If 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 we put even one hand on a woman, we going to jail. Don't risk your freedom over a thought. She hit me in the head right here. Look, man, if it, yeah, that, I watched Uncle Curtis and Ain't B do it. Both of them stabbed one another. Back then, didn't nobody go to jail. Back then, you told the police, man, she done something wrong, and you convinced the police she done something wrong. Keyword, we not back then no more. Done something wrong, you get the whoop again. <laughs> no, so, hold on. But this is what I'm saying. Ooh. Equal <clears throat> opportunity, equal rights. Women want the same rights as men. It's called mutual combat. If you hit me and I hit you and the police show up and we both agreed to fight, nobody goes to jail. Bitch, if you hit me, I'm hitting you. Now let's tell the police we had a mutual combat. They already passed that. They already passed that level. Though. They hit each other all the time. It's like two fucking motor motor combat fighters. They hit each other all the time. So no, nobody go to jail. Bitch, you hit me. Do you think Blueface is scared of her? Or scared of obviously, you know, as a man, like I'm even taught, like I, you know, I've been in arguments with women, right? And the first thing I usually do, I try, I call my mama. My mama <laughs> usually say, even if it's my house, run out of the house in the middle of the road that everybody can see you, and wait, I'm on my way, because at the end of the day, you a black mama Demix. That's true. That's true. That's true. What he about to say next. Man in America, and when you a black man, it don't matter, even if she done hit you twenty times. If you do anything, which might even be to defend yourself, it will not be looked like that in the in the eyes of the law, and definitely not when the police show up. Hell no. So that's how I'm taught. If somebody do something wrong to me, I don't care about it. You but you got to. Man, if you do something wrong to me, man, if I hadn't done anything wrong to you, and you do something wrong to me, the consequence. But that's the thing about the relationship that they got with Blueface and Sean Rock. Blueface could be having a regular conversation. And she might just deck the nigga in his shit for no reason. They having a regular conversation. You know what I'm saying? She start drinking. She start drinking. She start drinking. When that alcohol gets involved, that's when it's the worst ever. She start drinking. She start drinking. Blue face just, you know, having a regular conversation. Soon as she turned up, she might just bang. Mike Tyson, that nigga. You don't know when, you don't know when the hit going to come. I mean, I ain't done nothing to you. If you hit me and I ain't hit you, the consequences don't matter to me. So what do you think is... It's, there's another thought that says maybe there's certain... I don't know. Maybe Blueface, maybe Blueface need need a body slam ass one time. Put her in a nice little DDT. 
Cripples cross face. Put it in the leg lock. Little swan time bomb. There's certain men who get with women who their idea of kinky foreplay. But that's cause that the last, like every time she show her ass out, that's content for the uh for the reality show that they got. So that ain't about nothing. He liked that type of shit. Let her get on her six inch high heels and fucking jump on your back or stomach or now, kick you in the balls. That happens. Well, I think I I'm think, trying to figure out I, why this is happening. Well, I, I, I'm 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 I, I'm looking at it and I'm saying okay. Hold on, yeah. uh, I'm looking at it and I'm saying okay. Uh, this guy publicly has issues with his mom. He disrespectful to his mom. Mm, I forgot she about that. Disrespectful to his mom. Forgot about that. He's disrespectful to her father. She's assaulted his mom. He's assaulted her father. Uh, man, this is just for a reality show. All that just for a reality, man. It couldn't be me. This is all. Uh, this is some deep domestic violence shit, homie. That 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 we are turning the blinds eye to, and, and and we lack compassion because it's happening to a black man, and it ain't happening to a woman. Facts. Uh, if it was the other way around, there's no way. No, yeah, they would shut that shit down ASAP. We watched this chick split this man's head open, homie. Bust his head open. That's crazy. And vacuum glass out his head. She put tape on. <laughs> Only to brag about having multiple abortions, homie, with, with no level of sensitivity. I mean, he also admitted, though, that she's been with 10 men in the last year. But he's still fucking her wrong. So what does that say about him? <sighs> wow. He's still fucking her wrong. And then when the baby show up, he comes out with even more shame as a black man. Say, oh, well, it ain't mine. Well, I wouldn't have said that, and I know I've been fucking her wrong. I wouldn't give a fuck if she was sleeping with 20 niggas. Nigga, I've been laying with her raw, so it is a possibility, y'all. So, hey, let me just see. I ain't going to come out and reject the baby. Nigga, I've been laying with her. This this been my, me and this bro got a show together. So now I want to shame her? Too late now. You know what I'm saying? Unk ain't never tell no lies. Academics, get the frames right, man. It look like you shot this episode with a cricket camera, but that's all. Leave a like if you enjoyed the video. Like, comment, subscribe. I'm out.